Good morning. Today is my very first day of college. It's nice and early in the morning, so let's get ready for the day. <laughs> These things are crazy. They're like literally little toothpaste tablets. <laughs> Here's the first day of school outfit I was thinking. It's like a fun little vest moment. What do we think? Now I'm just trying to decide if I want my hair down because it's kind of cute, honestly. Or I could easily put it up in like a messy bun and that could also be pretty cute too. It's going to be kind of cold out today. I think it's literally like 16 degrees. So not that that plays a factor into how I'm going to have my hair, but... <laughs> Whoa! My amazing roommate made breakfast! <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Ah! I just showed up to campus and classes started like 15 minutes, but all of the parking is taken. Ah! All the parking is taken. I don't know what I'm gonna do, honestly, but we're gonna find a place now. <laughs> Update it's like 30 minutes later. I finally found some parking. I don't even know if it's a good parking spot, but I have to go walk to class now. Class literally already started, so. First day is a little chaotic. I didn't know the parking was gonna be so crazy. So I think now I have probably like a 15 minute walk, so I'm gonna probably have to run. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just barely finished my classes for the day and now I have a very super busy schedule for the rest of everything. So I need to go pick up books and I think that's the first stop that we're gonna go make. I picked up a book but I realized that I actually ordered the wrong one on accident so now I need to go find the right one. Oh my gosh, I have so many updates for y'all. First day of school, check! That was crazy. I need to do a whole debriefing with y'all here and let you know everything that just went down because this was such a chaotic morning. So I woke up super early this morning, like way earlier than I probably needed to, just because I wanted to make sure I had enough time to like film some of getting ready and film my first day of school, but also that I had enough time to find parking. Basically my college has like a bunch of parking passes and a bunch of parking lots but there's no like assigned spots for the cars if that makes any sense like you don't have a specific spot that's designated yours it's just kind of like first come first serve so audrey my older sister she had gone here before and she told me she's like parking fills up so fast so like beware be ready girl and i was like okay gotcha i'm gonna go to school early so i did <laughs> but i got there and I am not even joking y'all. Every single spot was taken. I went to like five of the lots that I could park in. All of them taken. So at this point, I mean, I vlogged a little bit in the morning. Y'all saw, I was like, I don't know if you could tell, but I was feeling really stressed. I was like, dude, classes are already starting. I am a 15 minute walk away at this point. And I was like, I have nowhere to park. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can't just drive back home because then I'll miss all of my classes for the day. So my scattered brain was like running through my options and I just decided to park at a restaurant, which I don't recommend doing because that can get you towed. I was not thinking, honestly, like looking back on the choice, I probably would have just gone back to the apartment because this was not my proudest moment. <laughs> not to mention, I had ran through this schedule yesterday and I had like planned on parking at a place that was only like five minutes away from the building that I needed to be in. So I literally didn't bring a coat, which I know was so not smart of me, but I just was not thinking straight. I was like, surely I'm gonna get a spot. So I was like, I literally had to walk like 20 minutes in the freezing cold and it's snowing with no coat and no gloves or anything. My hands are so cold still. And literally all throughout the day, I went to my classes and all throughout the day, I was just thinking like, I hope my car doesn't get towed. Like, ah. Uh. But as you can tell, my car is still here. Woo! 
<laughs> literally such a tender mercy i think god knew that i was so stressed for today and that i was like it's my first day of school oh, i feel so blessed that nothing happened but oh, it's been an adventure so anyways i went to all of my classes and i went and picked up my books so I should be set and ready for the semester, so that's exciting. Now I'm gonna go back home and get some lunch because I'm pretty hungry. And I think I'm gonna call my parents and give them the little updates of my first day of school. <laughs> I made it back home. I haven't actually made lunch yet, so I'm just snacking on some veggies. But say hi to mom! Woo! Hi guys! How is everyone back at home? What are y'all up to? Um, kind of the same routines. I had to do some errands in town today, and now I'm just kind of decluttering. Nice, nice. Well, I have a story to tell you. Just you wait. Okay. Good morning, it's day two. I'm starting off my day by making a healthy and nutritious breakfast of mini frosted spooners. <laughs> it's so early. I am here on campus and I got a parking spot, woo! Basically, I woke up super early and I dropped off some of my friends to their super early morning classes. And then, cause I was like, that works perfect. Cause then I can literally just go scout out a parking spot and then, um literally just camp out and do my makeup over here. So I've got a bit of time. I also just like brought my breakfast to go and I have some emails and things I need to respond to. So I'm thinking this is the way to go. I just gotta like get ready in my car instead. <laughs> Today's schedule should be really fun. I have some afternoon classes, which I'll be curious to see um, how that goes. Makeup is done. We're going to class and I'm actually wearing my coat. So I feel like I'm much better prepared today and I'm excited to start. <laughs> All right, day two, I just barely made it back home. Today was really good. It was really busy. I was running around a lot because I forgot that we had like a devotional that we get to attend. After my classes, I got to listen to the devotional and it was the president of the school, this university, and he was just talking about how like just to think celestial and to think like see things with like an eternal perspective. I feel like it helps a lot in the school year because sometimes school is really stressful honestly and it's just a lot it could be overwhelming but i really like how he talked about how with god all things are possible and that if we rely on him throughout the school year we can receive the strength that we need in order to be able to handle like the workload that we have or whatever schedules or whatever personal life things we may be going through now i'm back home and I was just looking at my schedule and oh my goodness, I actually have quite a bit of homework that I need to do. So I guess I'll update y'all then, see how it goes. <laughs> I just finished my little afternoon classes and it was really good. Honestly, I spent most of the day on campus today, which I was not expecting. Our Wi-Fi is not working. And so I just stayed in the library for most of the day and did a lot of my homework there. I guess I'll see y'all later. Good night. Day three of my first week of school. It is currently snowing like crazy outside. I already went to all of my classes this morning and they went really well. Today was like the first official day that they started teaching things. I feel like the other two days, it was just like reviewing the syllabus, setting the expectations for the classes. We had some homework, but it wasn't like super crazy. Today was actually really fun. I really enjoyed all of my classes. I'm taking a writing class that I really, really like and it's like making me super excited to just like read and write and get into English and everything. It's definitely getting easier, but it's also the first weeks. But anyways, I just barely got in the mail this package. I thought it could be fun to unbox it with y'all. So this is a package from Discount Dance. I just ordered a bunch of dance supplies because I am taking a dance class actually. And I don't have like literally any of the supplies. So I ordered so many leotards and my plan is to try them all on and then return the ones that don't really fit me well. Okay, so let's see. We have these tights. I got this on a mega sale, so feeling very proud of myself. They are very good. 
Oh, I'm really excited for this one. This is so cute. It's like a little three-fourths sleeve moment. I really like this style a lot, so I'm hoping that one fits me. I also got another style of leotard from Block. Oh, whoa. The fabric is like way different on this one compared to this one. That's kind of crazy. I don't know if you could see, but like there's like a pinch front and then this back is a little bit lower, so I'm gonna have to try it on and see. This one is just like your basic leotard because I was like, you know, might as well. It's the same brand as <laughs> the shoes that I got, so I, I really like this brand. It's the Capezio. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. Just your basic cute little ballet leotard, so okay. Um, I'm gonna go try them all on and figure out what works. Okay, I think this is the one that we're gonna go with. I tried on the other two, and although I do like the cut, it just kind of fit a little bit weird. I feel like, I don't know, it's so hard to find one that like works well with you, so. This one feels the most comfortable. I feel like I'll be able to dance well in it, so we're gonna go with that one. So now, I have a busy rest of the day. I might go to the library and do some homework, but first I need to stay at the apartment a little bit and try and figure out parking pass stuff. There's so many random things. And like, insurance stuff, ugh. <laughs> Hello again. It's kind of late at night, honestly, but I've got quite a bit of work to do, so I'm currently here editing. Look at that. That's the setup. I'm also doing a lovely little face mask just to finish off the night. My snack of choice during editing is chicken and a biscuit. It's so good. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna work on editing tonight, and I don't know that I'll be able to get it all done but I'm gonna get started. I just have to say I feel so blessed that this is my job because I really love that I can work from wherever I'm at. Like I can just be in my apartment with a face mask on editing and I think that's so awesome. That's so cool. So I just am feeling very blessed. Honestly, I feel like the sleep deprivation is finally hitting at this point. It's actually Thursday now, so I don't think I gave you any updates today besides this one, but today was the first day that I really started to feel tired in classes and it was like so hard to stay awake. Also, I have to tell you today was crazy because I got free food not once, not twice, but three times today. I don't know how that happened, but I'm feeling so blessed. So the first time was at lunch and I was actually going to my class, but there was a different class that was like finishing up in that classroom if that makes sense. The other class, conveniently enough, was having like a little like celebration thing or something. I don't even know what was going on, honestly, but they had bagels and chocolate milk. And I saw one of my friends in there and they like invited me to come in because I like waved from the hall and they're like, oh my goodness, Jordan, come in. So I went in there and everyone was so nice and they, were, they literally gave me a full on bagel. My favorite bagel, by the way, the blueberry one with a strawberry cream cheese. It was so delicious. So I had that plus chocolate milk and it was literally perfect timing because I was already getting really hungry for lunch so and then at my night classes I have a professor that is literally so sweet and she like found out what our favorite treats are and she brought some of them to class it was so nice and then <laughs> after my very very last class of the day it was pretty late but they this one was like a separate class and I don't know if they're gonna do this all the time but they offered everyone like a giant free dinner like they were hosting this thing i don't even know but basically i got a free sloppy joe for dinner and salad and it was very scrumptious and i really did not have to cook it all today so that was kind of nice but yeah i'm gonna finish my editing for the night and then go to bed because i'm so tired good night peace and love Mwah. Good morning, y'all. I'm so happy because today I got to sleep in a little bit. Already, it's been a great morning. <laughs> I always love going to bed with my hair in braids because it makes doing my hair so, so easy in the morning. Like, literally, look at this. Okay, guys, fit check. <laughs> I literally just got more free food. I don't know how this keeps happening. We got our groceries. I literally have not moved out of this seat the entire day. I've just been like editing for hours, grinding, trying to get this video done because I'm gonna post it tomorrow. But I just got in our order of groceries. So let's see what we got. Carrots and hummus. This is gonna seem weird, but we got beef bouillon. Sour cream, honey syrup. And then we just have basic school supplies like a notebook and I needed a giant three ring binder. <gasps> Hello! Yay! 
your home. <laughs> I'm gonna go spend time with her. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Road trip! Girls road trip! Oh, we got our crochet stuff. Crochet. Don't even worry about it. Where are we headed? Red Rock Canyon! Rock climbing! Rock climbing for the weekend. Whoa! I'm there! Red Rock Canyon. Oh, this is very pretty. Oh, yeah. oh wait, I did it wrong. Oh, cut that part out. The pressure, <laughs> the pressure is too much. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! We made it! <laughs> yup. Yeah. Whoa, oh yeah. Alright. Wait, wait, here. Keep going. Dude, if you could smell my feet, I'm kidding. He's almost to the top! Give me some. Okay. Be sure to post this. <laughs> 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 Alright, let's go. 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 I want you so cute. I love her. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, Jordan. Hey guys, today we're in Malaye, which means that I am in charge of not dropping the person climbing. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, look at that view. Oh, that was lame. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, okay, don't worry. Oh, I think I did. I'm pretty sure. I think I did. I think I did it. It was in the frame. It was zoomed out. Keanu, you're getting a close up right now. Yeah. Yes, but make sure it shows me before you're done because you want your slack hand to be facing out so that when you're. Yeah, so I need to fix this, right? Yeah, you just flip it. What? Girl power. Great job. I don't know why I'm like so I'm just gonna possibly scream all over. Headed home. Vlogging. It's so beautiful out. We just finished rock climbing for the day. Okay, watch out. <laughs> it's a little chilly, but that was so fun. Dinner time! Why is it so close to our face? We're gonna go around and say our favorite part of climbing today. My favorite part was... My favorite part was belaying. It was actually so much fun and I had done it before but it had been a few years. My favorite... Oh, <laughs> sorry. My favorite part was definitely when um, Dan asked Hannah if she knew how to lead belay and Hannah took her agree agree and she said, I bought this, this is mine. Yeah. And that was not an answer to the question because she actually was stressing about not knowing how, but she, <laughs> she fooled them, it was really funny. Uh, my favorite part of climbing was Hayden climbing without his shoes. Yes. And we yeah. all see his feet, not good. the feet, not the feet. <laughs> crocheting. My favorite part was crocheting. <laughs> my favorite part was the beautiful <laughs> sunset. Whoa, the sphere in Nevada. Hello, hello. The long weekend is over. I'm so sad it's over, but it was such a good weekend. So much fun. So we went rock climbing outdoors. That was my very first time outdoor rock climbing. I'm really glad that I went. It was kind of crazy. I decided like 30 minutes before the car was leaving that I was gonna join and so it was like 30 minutes before I was like hurrying frantically packing my bags and hurrying like eating food and yeah it was wild but seriously such a great first little weekend with friends and everything I honestly only knew like half the people and so it was cool getting to meet a lot of new people and make new friendships that's one of my goals this semester in college is to be more social because for me I'm a naturally pretty quiet shy introverted person which I think is funny because I know like online and through videos I probably seem more extroverted but naturally I I'm more introverted so anyways I don't know if that's gonna be the case for like every weekend here obviously not like there's gonna be somewhere to stay at home but that was really cool I'm just feeling so blessed to be here I'm feeling so blessed that I get to take classes and learn more and further my education like 
what a gift that is that is so cool anyways I'm feeling excited for the upcoming weeks and everything and I am planning time to go and visit my family again because I do already miss them and I've already FaceTimed them like literally three times every day thank y'all for watching comment down below are you in school right now are you preparing for college are you in college I want to know are you in high school I hope y'all have a great school year and if you're not in school that you just have a great amazing year but yeah chat with me in the comments chat with me on Instagram love y'all so much bye